This video is to explain the Cubone skull mask that I'm now selling in my Etsy store. The link is in the description. Um, first of all, it's just big enough to fit all heads, um, but it's not too big. It fits my head just fine, and I have a pretty big head, and it's fit everyone who's tried it on so far. So it should fit your head, no problem. But if for some reason it doesn't, then send it back to me and I'll adjust it for you. Um, I made it out of a plastic that's easy to carve. I wanted people to be able to customize it um, so you can carve your own cracks into it. You can carve it with a Dremel or any other router or what. what's also really easy to use is a soldering iron. You can carve this plastic with a soldering iron actually. Um, it carves really easily that way, but if you do that, just make sure you have a window open or have proper ventilation. It doesn't give off a lot of fumes, but you know, just to, just to be safe. Um, it comes with foam pads on the inside. If you want me to glue them in for you, send me a message before you, before you buy it. Um, otherwise I'll just send send it to you with the pads taped in just in case you want to cut the pads smaller or glue them somewhere else. Uh, I figured most people would just wear this as like like you'd wear a hat but for those of you who want to wear it as a mask you can do that too. You'll just have to attach some elastic strap or elastic cord and the best place to, to glue that on the inside is right where I have the tape here, just right immediately behind the the eye, the eye hole. Um, uh, I think that's it. If you have any uh, more questions about it, it's best to message me on my Etsy store. I check that more often than I check this YouTube channel. So thank you for watching.